Rock Bottom, Preston Hotel, Community Tracks, Doll Factory, SCU Building, We're on the City Museum. So that's chapter six, I believe, out of eleven. <clears throat> and uh, I, I do remember this one. I, you know, I, I don't remember very much of this game from the last time that I played it. It's been so long, but I, I mean, this was one of the ones that stuck out to me is when I think back to this game, one that was more intriguing, definitely caught my attention more. So I'm, I'm kind of, I know there's a couple parts that I do remember, but I actually don't remember when they take place in the chapter. I don't know if they're at the beginning or later. So, and I believe that this one leads to, there's either an outdoor level before like this, like log cabin, like this winter log cabin wet level, or, or just, or that outdoor part with a plane crash goes to the winter log cabin so hopefully get to I'd, I'd like to complete the log cabin level with the bear by the end of the stream hopefully okay that's right this is the mayor I think that there's too little blood it should be splattered all over the place hmm. oh, yeah, flashlight I love um that they did include ooh, what we got going on here. Looks like the perp used the wheelbarrow to transport the body. The first one, so. <clears throat> oh, well, this is exactly. Ah, something that I really like about it. It's a good, creepy music. Wait, did it come this way? No, that's just the way the floor is. I need to put this down and get my flashlight. I can't see anything. All right. Doesn't mean dick to me. <laughs> Here, let me give you a lift. Yeah, that is right. We climb over. Due to theft, the museum is beefed up to the full of cigars as possible. If you need to take them down, don't you go up. I'll take that under advisement. Optional. That's right, okay. Ethan, this is Rosa. I just received that little present you sent me. It's a bit disturbing to think that SKX is still alive. Last time I saw that psycho, half his face lined the inside of a trunk. Well, the body was never recovered, so I guess the chance he survived was always there. Mr. Thomas, the coroner just arrived. He's examining the body now. Slowly, I'm required to walk here, but I'm just being cautious. <laughs> that looks like a crime scene. Okay, this is what we know so far. The victim <clears throat> is Mayor Rachel Mars, age 55, found dead inside the City Museum of Natural History. The body has severe lacerations about the back, chest, and arms, resulting in excessive hemorrhaging. There's also an extensive tearing of muscle and ligament within the same region. Head decapitated just above the collarbone. The whereabouts is still unknown. All right, and now for the note you sent me. Oh, Found shoot. on the victim's body was a piece of paper with strangely drawn eyes on one side, and on the other, the acronym of a serial killer known as Serial Killer X. Find any fingerprints on the paper? 
Yes, I ran it through IAFIS, and guess whose name popped up? Leland Van Horn. Van Horn. I don't need to tell you this, but let's make it official. Leland Van Horn, a.k.a. Serial Killer X, or just SKX, was allegedly responsible for nine serial murders in the greater metro area. He's the nephew to Malcolm Van Horn, and was thought to be dead, killed by a gunshot to the face. His body was never recovered. And Horn nursed his nephew back to health? I'd say it's the most likely scenario. I have a theory. SKX gets one in the grill. His own flesh and blood, Malcolm Van Horn, nurses him back to health. SKX turns on his uncle and kills him. For perhaps the same reason he murders Rachel Mars. Keep searching the museum. We need more information. Receiving image. Good work. That's an odd-shaped saw. Looks medieval in origin. Get a shot of the handle, will you? Part of it's the handle. That's the handle, oh yeah, fingerprints. Alright. <clears throat> Excellent. Look at that. A fingerprint. Give me a moment. However, after running the print through IAFIS, I'm able to get a positive match on our suspect, SKX. I'd say SKX is very much alive and is now the prime suspect in the murder of Rachel Williams. What about the show? Yeah, I hear the museum will feature one of the largest A clanking up here, and I don't like it. I kind of want to try to knock one of them out. See, I didn't kill him. Okay, I'm in the surveillance room. Find the backup drive, and let's see if our favorite madman has made a cameo. Goddamn backup drives, what? Kill him. Look at this dude. <laughs> Wait till you see the. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> well, I'll probably be my smartest. Bitch! <laughs> it worked out okay, though. I'm 
fast as fuck, boy. Still fast as fuck, boy. Come get some. <laughs> I don't think you have any idea how fast I really am. I'm fast as fuck, boy. Feels like a trap chasing after this person. That's lame. I have a fucking sword, though. <clears throat> there we go. Look at me, medieval knight. Oh, never mind. Never mind. I don't feel. I don't feel so strong anymore. Why did he just turn to fire? Damn. Run. Parts of the game where I have to just run. Good idea, Ryan. Jesus. Fucking. Who is this guy?
This is the time where I'm actually supposed to figure this out, I guess. Yeah? This is actually doing anything. Looking more beat up every time I see you. I think I overstayed my welcome. I found something when investigating Van Horn's body. Metal pieces? No, no, no. Something better. I found traces of fecal matter on his shoes. Let me finish. It belongs to an endangered deer species found only in the Black Lake region. Uh -oh. You mean the wildlife preserve up north? Yeah, I figure the best way to track SKX is to start with Van Horn and work our way back. Seems like a long shot if you ask me. Two hour flight tops. I think Thomas gets so beat up working. <sighs> All right. I could use him sleep. <clears throat> Good. Dorland here has volunteered to take you. What do you hope to find up there? The target just boarded the plane. Huh. Ethan, your chest x-ray shows you do have vocal cords similar to Van Horn's. But even more bizarre. I'm related to Van Horn, is that what you're saying? The thought crossed my mind. However, I was able to confirm that he did not share blood with that family. That's comforting. But you still think I'm connected somehow. Yes, I do. Oh, this seems kind of crazy, that's all. When you land, search the lodge thoroughly and learn as much as you can. It's been abandoned for decades, but I have a hunch both Van Horns were there recently. Huh? <sighs> How much time we got left? Hey, buddy, did you hear me? Hello, Ethan. We don't have much time, so I'll get right to the point. Your old boss, Pharaoh, is trying to protect you. <clears throat> Have you taken a moment to contemplate the meaning of this? He's the one that hired you. He guided you through the ranks of SCU and has kept a close watch on your career. Perhaps he's done this under false pretenses. He may have ulterior motives using you. Something to think about when choosing your friends. Of course. You made it. How 
was your flight? Slept like a baby. Good. What do you have? Receiving evidence. A human arm? Ew. Should he? Isn't that right? Get up! Finish the job! Kill him before he ruins everything! No! Do it! Remember who you are! I risk everything. Find the voice! out at Svensson's Magic Theater. Have you heard of it? <laughs> yeah, I think so. Meet me there as soon as you can. And make sure you're not followed. Okay, I'm on my way.
Oh, bird going straight into it. Defeat alcohol demon. Great, so we start off with a boss. Well, that's epic. Do I get to... Jesus. It's goddamn Jackie Chan. Get away. It's okay. You were having a nightmare. <laughs> nightmare. Damn. My head is killing me. You're exhausted. We both are. <sighs> like I was saying, SKX is out of the picture. Dorland and the Oro are our main concern. This may end up being a wild goose chase, but if we're right, the magic man will <clears throat> help us. Dude, this is getting alive. Oh, both of them. There you go, bitch. Alright. Push in the sword. Great. That's not weird. Well, I can't see shit. I'm glad that I picked up this fire axe, though. I'm really like hoping that this axe is a good idea. And like a bird, you find retreat impossible. I'm not here to play your fucked up games, Magic Man. No. No, not like a bird. Not like those other helpless people lining the bowels of the city. Enough babbling. Come out so I can see you. You're not so easily influenced. That much is obvious. That, that would be so Ordinary. That's right. I need to put him on fire. All right. Mr. Thomas, how do you know who I am? Fear travels fast. Start making some sense. <laughs> Remendium, the remedy, was supposed to be a myth, a bedtime story. But now, uh, you've made them think otherwise. You can all go to hell. Wait! Please! It's a gift! The ideal body, perfectly tuned from birth, capable of resonating a sound so powerful it can destroy flesh <laughs> and bone. It's what they fear most, a power greater than theirs. This is bullshit. Are you a member of the Aura? A sick, incestuous organization? No, no, not anymore. But I can tell you, they are on the verge of suffocating this city. What? Let's just say, Big Brother is all grown up and hungry for power. Where can I find them? Oh, you, you don't know what you're asking. I can't. All right. Uh, the peninsula. The answers you want are there. Peninsula. To the old, the young, and the weak at heart. It only gets more fantastical, more, dare I say, fucked up from here. 
<laughs> Jesus Christ, still hit me? Jump to bus. Jump to bus. This motherfucker. Okay. Getting out. Gotta run this way, pretty sure. Well, that bitch is throwing stuff at me. That's. Have to call for help. You stay right here. Rosa. You'll be okay. Don't worry. No. Trust no one. Don't let them get to you. I won't. Now just sit tight. I'll be right back. Really? <clears throat> That's how the final. Enjoy the scenic route, asshole! Cutting it a bit close, wouldn't you say? Well, you made it. That's the important thing. Anyway, the you-know-what has really hit the fan. You've uncovered something big, and I suspect over the next few weeks, more will be weeded out. Good thing, too. Some really influential people belong to the Oro. Hey, buddy. Soon as they fix that leg up, let's say you and I go get a drink. <laughs> I don't think so, LaRue. Right on. Hey, man. Call me Pierce. My friends call me Pierce. <sighs> What I need is some sleep. 
Credits. It's a really long pause. Oh. Continue. Oh, okay. Uh, Mr. President, what about the increase in violence? It appears to be a national problem. We're looking into the issue. We're also supporting all local agencies in their efforts to... Oh, um, excuse me for a moment. 